when you have different applications in a single stack and do you get frustrated by just switching between applications or your users have faced some similar issues with just switching or going back and forth between different applications then you can use the application url alias application url alias was introduced in 8.4 version if you look at this url you will find the url path as app slash then an identifier right so this is the application alias and you see there is an underscore because we never explicitly launched the application and pega has launched this url for us okay let me be more clear where we can find this application url alias if you open this application rule and in the application definition we can find the configurations when you create a new application pega by default adds you the application url alias and you can always change this url alias but just make sure after you deploy to production if you change this then you have to update this at multiple places so it is always good that before you move the application to production make sure you have the right application url alias so in my case i have this is my application url alias right so what i can do is i can just copy this and then you will be prompted to re login so what it means is we are launching the application the my flight application in a new session since i am using community edition i can use this login with sso to just quickly login into the application so here as you can see i have logged in into my flights application exclusively by using the identifier now let me do one more thing i will also log in the other application my banks application now i have copied the application url alias for my banks application let me open a new tab and then do the same thing now you see it tries to have a new session a new requester session it again asks for login so i can log in with sso now you can see i have launched two different applications which is into the same infrastructure into a different tabs i can do whatever things i want for example i can create a case from here and then here i can work on data or channels you can work independently on different applications this can be an interesting use case for your business application users if they want to switch between different applications